as you can see there's still not much to look at out here so I'm going to go inside and for this video I'm going to do a voiceover and show you some clips from last year. I thought it was time to do a little channel update just to let you know where we've been where we're going and some of the changes that have been going on and uh, some time management and just some few plans that I've got for this year and just let kind of let you know what's going on. As some of you might know, YouTube's been uh, making some changes lately, and one of the things they've uh, done is they've demonetized some of the smaller channels. Uh, that won't affect this channel, but I do have another channel uh, that I thought I would mention in case you're interested in nature type videos. I put uh, most of my nature stuff over there: animals, birds. Just a little bit of everything. Occasionally some plant stuff too, but if you want to check it out, I'd appreciate it. Uh, I think I'm somewhere around 950 subscribers and the uh, new threshold is a thousand, so I'd kind of like to reach that. So if you're interested in that, please take a look. And I'll put a link down in the description box to my other channel and also at the end of this video if you want to check it out. Last year we started with about 2,000 subscribers and we ended up with 6,000. Uh, so I want to say a big thank you to everybody who subscribed. Uh, I mentioned it before, but without you guys, I'm just a guy talking to himself in his backyard. So I really do appreciate every single view and every single comment. Just thanks a lot. I really do appreciate it. Even though YouTube's going through a lot of changes right now, and some of those changes do affect how I do my videos, I'm hoping that most of my subscribers will never know the, notice the difference, and uh, that's what I'm shooting for this year. I'm going to try to keep posting uh, videos consistently, at least several times a week uh, during the summer, during the, ro the growing season, uh, maybe even more than that. Some of the changes on YouTube uh, are making things just a little bit harder to do. It's taking more time and that coupled with the fact that I have less time to do things now. I have more things going on in my personal life. It's just going to be a little bit harder to get videos done. So I'm approaching a point where I'm kind of getting burned out a little bit. Uh, I'm going to fight through that. Uh, I'm hoping nobody will even notice, but I just want to make people aware that uh, care enough to watch this that it's not as easy as it once was. It's no big deal or anything. Uh, it's just one of those things, and I'll get through it, no problem. As many of you know, I got interested in grafting last year, and I plan to do some more of that this year. And soon I think I'm going to be doing some how-to videos, maybe top grafting and side grafting and cleft grafting. Recently I did my first uh, top graft and so far it's still alive after several days so I'm really encouraged by that. And this year I plan to grow probably 10 or 12 different types of tomatoes and Probably 10 or 12 different peppers and maybe four or five different eggplants. I really, I still don't have a, a list that's set in stone, but I'm getting closer to having that. So hopefully I'll be able to give more precise information in, in a week or two. And this year, since I'm going to be a little short on time, I just won't be able to watch as many videos as I'd like to, so I apologize to the people who I subscribe to. I just uh, won't be able to watch as many videos as I used to. My channel's getting uh, big enough now where I'm getting a little bit of interest from people wanting to collaborate and I've also had a couple of sponsorship offers uh, for a couple of videos, but I'm really resisting that unless it really fits what I'm doing. Uh, if I was already using something and already liked it, uh, I'd probably 
do a video like that, but so far I'm kind of uh, just wanting to keep it at that and make sure things fit what I'm doing already. Even though I haven't done any sponsored videos, I'm still looking at things and trying to make sense of how many hours I'm investing in uh, YouTube videos. Uh, I'd like to get to the point where it makes financial sense. So I'm still exploring options and uh, if I make any changes I'll try to let you guys know before it happens. But so far I'm just going to keep doing what I've been doing.